Most people have heard of the wave particle duality of light. Light sometimes diffracts and interferes with itself, a behavior of waves, but sometimes seems to be made of packets of energy or photons, acting like a particle. But if waves can act like particles, can particles act like waves? In 1926, Louis de Broglie hypothesized that anything can display wave or particle properties depending on the experiment. He took an equation for wavelength that worked for rays of light and worked out the wavelength an electron would have if it was to be a wave. In 1927, George Thomson fired electrons between the atoms of carbon. This was the result. This pattern meant that the electrons interfered with themselves, so they must have diffracted, like waves. And they diffracted the way that was predicted by de Broglie, so particles can act like waves. But if matter can act like waves, you may be thinking, why can we never see ourselves diffract? Let's look at the equation again. As you increase the mass, you decrease the wavelength. For macroscopic objects, the wavelength is too small to visibly diffract around anything. This effect is only really visible at the quantum scale. 